Hey, what's up guys? Thank you for watching another of my videos. What I got here is an unboxing. We're actually gonna unbox the Dragon Radar from Proplica. This is the actual radar us. Really was it can't get to be that Dragon Radar. Um, I'm just gonna show you the box. I'm looking at this camera, but I got another camera right on top. It brings the little stickers and the Funimation and uh, toy and all that. It's the machinations, Bandai, blah, blah, blah. All these letters, it comes in Japanese. I do not understand anything, really. Um, so I'm just gonna try to get this going, guys. Um, I had it for a while, never really unboxed it. So it got a little banged up, the box. And sadly, it did go through damage, the box only, because I'm um, moving in here and there. But I am glad the stickers are all right. So we're gonna try to do this thing. Okay, so this is the box, guys. This is Premium Bandai. What's Premium Bandai? Uh, the blah, blah, blah. Just their uh, actual website, so you can buy from them. So uh, let's look at this. Oh, wow, it looks pretty nice. So it brings a little wristband thing or neck thing i really don't know it depends how you want to carry it very very actually very nice the capsule corp this thing so you can hold it can you see it guys um i guess this little thing is so you can actually put the dragon radar on there as a standing all right, so let's take it out of the box. Of the box, the bag, I'm sorry. Oh, this is the real deal, man. When I was a kid, I always wish I could have had one of these. Uh, I really like the, the texture. You can actually touch the black paint here and it gives you the squares. The green is just beautiful. The white, just uh, really real white. I'll bring some um, batteries, I guess I must bring them already. Let's take this out. This is so the battery don't touch the fuse, so you don't kill the battery. <gasps> wow. Okay. So we actually got it going. Oh, wow. I don't know if you can see it guys. Actually, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Dragon Balls. Now one move towards where you are. The other one move right next to you. So you can actually use it like for for hunting the Dragon Balls or searching for them. So each one keeps getting closer to you each time you press it. So I guess when you got all seven together, something must go on. All right, so we got it there. I don't really know if you guys can see it. Uh, let me try to check this in the camera. Well, okay, the camera really gets a good view of it. All right. So then. You're actually call, calling Sharon. This is the sound is pretty good. Do not know what he said. You know what I actually really like is that right now, for example, it's it doesn't have any Dragon Ball. So I guess the the dragon just gave you the wishes and flew away, and the, the Dragon Balls turned into stone. 
So I really like the sound because it's the original Dragon Ball sound. So, all right, so, uh, all right, so that's what happens. Same thing, same thing over and over. That's all the sounds it has. And uh, it's pretty nice, actually. I really have to give him a 10 out of 10. It's very simple. Um, it holds its value, like, <laughs> it holds its value in my heart, I guess. Let's see how that, can you put this right here, I guess? Yeah, there will be a good, good choice. Mm. Just looking, this is pretty much the whole complete set. It looks very nice to put it into your home uh, and display it under a glass or something like a clear PVC um, uh, displaying uh, areas. I really forgot what you call it, but that would be a good one to actually have it as. Only bad thing is you cannot really turn it off. I feel is um, the lights are pretty good when you look at them. The LED lights they come in different spots on whenever it's on. Oh well, it turns off it by itself. Okay, so it does turn on by itself, and it it starts right at the beginning. Just you, no Dragon Balls. So. I really like that idea. I really, really enjoy it. So you leave it there for a while. It's gonna turn itself off, or if not, you just put back the little plastic that comes there. There, and there is no contact, so you don't have to actually worry about the battery getting messed up. So I really have to say, as as a proplica, it's very good. It's very light. Uh, I do think it was a little kind of expensive to be $30 because this feels so simple but you know if it is simple everybody will make it overall it's it's a good price problem if you drop it, it's not gonna last I feel you can drop it two three times and this thing is gonna break LEDs or whatever this is plastic but we're, what I'm trying to say is the plastic is not strong plastic I feel it's it was cheap plastic for the price. I would expect a little less, like 20, 25. But the work that is inside, it's the value of it. Like the whole interactive kind of mode it has and how it brings back that original Dragon Ball kind of idea to it. So I really like it and enjoy it. Uh, I wish, I wish it had a different one that you could actually make a game of it, like high different Dragon Balls with uh, like a little GPS and you will have to look for it. It would be really fun, imagine, with your friends or, or your kids. I have a kid. So that would be a whole interactive kind of radar that will work. But overall, this one is pretty amazing. I really have to say it's it gives you the Dragon Ball feel. Uh, do not drop it, like I said, because the plastic doesn't seem it will stand very, like, um, very... <laughs> very actual like throwing or dropping from a, a height that is kind of like this tall or something I'm, I'm sure but something that is if you're gonna drop it from or it might split in a couple pieces or something the plastic is not the strongest but overall I feel what you pay as a pro clicker will give you what you deserve because you can save it you can put it as you can put it as a Dragon Ball radar, right? You can put it as a memory. Uh, you can put it there just to remind you the Dragon Ball was your thing when you were growing up. Overall, like I said, I give it an eight out of ten. Uh, I thought it was gonna be a heavy duty plastic, and I would have been happier because I have a kid, like I said, and he drops it. I will have to buy another one, but at the same time. There's a lot of work inside and the inside of it. So LED lights and the whole interaction, but it comes with everything needed to display. Um, the display little bottom part is perfect. So I think this is a very, very good Proplica. I'm really happy I actually get to unbox it finally. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, comment down below, subscribe, share. Um, until I see you next guys, have a good one. Peace, bye.
share.